guys hope you're doing great our today's question is odd even linked list given a singly linked list group all odd nodes together followed by the even nodes please note here we are talking about the node number not the values in the nodes you should try to do it in place the program should run in o of 1 space complexity and o of nodes time complexity for example the input is 1 2 3 4 5 null so we have to first group together the elements at the odd positions in the linked list which is 1 3 and 5 because they are at the first third and the fifth position and then it should be followed by a group of the elements at the even positions which is 2 and 4 because they are at the position 2 and 4 okay similarly in this example as you can see 2 3 6 and 7 they are at the odd position so they come first and then 1 5 and 4 they are at even positions and they come after that note the relative order inside both the even and odd groups should remain as it was in the input. The first node is considered odd, the second node even and so on. Okay. So this is a problem on linked list and before going any further, we'll just think about whatever other ways that we can solve this question. So yeah. These are the approaches that we have understood till now. So please pause the video, take a moment and then come back. All right. So here clearly we can use the two pointers approach because <clears throat> we have to rearrange the links right inside the link list. And to be able to do that, we will need two pointers. One that will point to the odd list and the other one that will point to the even list. Okay. So as we solve the question, it will get clearer. So since we don't want to use two different lists to store just the odd elements and just the even elements and then merge them together, we just want them to, to be just rearranged in a manner that they give us the output straight away. Right. So what we'll do is that we will, um, <clears throat> As you can see here, for example, this list, right? So we'll take three pointers in the beginning. One pointing to the odd head, which is one in this case. And the other two pointing to two, which are the even heads, right? Now, um, there's another question that we had solved on linked list where <clears throat> we had to do a similar operation. And we had to take two pointers pointing to the start because what happens is that your even head here, it will travel right to the end of the list that will be formed by the even nodes. And then if you want to come back to this, right, the head, you will have no way if you don't keep another pointer, right? So for example, here initially odd head points to one. And once we extract the odd elements sorry this should be three yeah so once we extract the odd elements odd head would reach five okay uh, or null rather and when we talk about even it will initially be at two and when we extract the even elements it will reach four right so so obviously after this we want to join them right um and, and in that case, we would want 5 to be pointing to the start of the list that contains the even elements, even position elements, right? So to, able, to be able to do that, we are capturing that in even, which does not move, right? So that at the end, we can say odd head dot next equals even so that 5 then points to 2 and we have our final answer. Okay, so let's see that in our code and I hope that should help okay so let's get started with this so okay right so base case should be if head equals null right that is there are no elements then just return head Okay, 
after that as we discussed we need to have list node odd head that will be equal to the head because first element is the head of the odd list right and we'll have even head and even right both of them so we can just say even head equals to head dot next that is the next element and just even equal to even head right the same same element right so now we have initialized our pointers now we want to iterate till right so we want to follow even right so till the point that even head becomes null or its next becomes null right so because what we'll be doing is that we will be first initializing odd head moving odd head then based on odd head we'll be uh, moving even head so at any point when even head becomes null or its next becomes null is the point where we want to stop right so um, our condition will be while this is not equal to null okay or this even head dot next is not equal to null i think it should be an and because in both cases we don't want to proceed so yeah let's see yeah we'll see when it runs okay <clears throat> so now what we want to do is that we want to break this link from 1 to 2 and make this 1 one's next point to 3 okay which is the next of the even head right so what we'll do is that oven uh, sorry <coughs> odd head um, dot next right equals to even head dot next right because two's next is three and we want to make sure that the next of one becomes three okay and then we also want to move odd head right so we just say that odd head equals to odd head dot next so basically we have moved odd head from one to three right okay now for the even so we do a similar operation so we say even head dot next equals to odd head dot next which is odd head is three currently so dot next is four so two should point to four correct so we say that odd head dot next and then similarly just even head equals to even head dot next because we want to move it to four now okay and after all of this is done we'll use our even so odd head dot next equals to even right and then we return head from this because we have changed everything head is still pointing to one and that's what the rearranged linked list looks like and that's what is our answer okay let's try and run this Okay, that's taking a lot of time. Well, I'm extremely sorry about that, guys. I don't know what's wrong with my internet these days. In the meanwhile, the time complexity for this would be O of n because we have traversed each node of the linked list only once, right? And the space complexity would be O of 1 because we are not using any extra 
variable or any um, other linked list to store the elements. So we're just rearranging the links. That's why it would be O of 1. <clears throat> Okay, it's connected. Let's just try again. Okay, we'll submit it. Great, okay. So hope you like this video and you find this helpful. If you do, please like, share and subscribe. Keep coding and take care guys.